Well, hello guys, it's Trex Person and Sam. Welcome back to another uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator video, everyone. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. Um, I don't know what the thumbnail's doing. It's it says it's EasyJet, and then the next minute it's the uh, British Airways thumbnail. I don't know what's going on. It's a bit of a mess. Um, yeah, sorry, I scared you again. Yeah, no, I should just start with hello, but it's not it's not as easy as that. Because uh, I know what happens on Switch. You end up saying hello, welcome to, and then for some reason, for people who are watching it live or if you record it. Um, it's like halfway through the commentary of like, you know, the beginning, so it's like, yeah, welcome back. You know, where's the hello amateur? You yeah, know, it kind of cuts it off, so I kind of give it like a 10 minute breather. Uh, I'm alright, right, yeah, so today we're not going to be doing SAS, we're going to be doing um, BA in the, uh, I think we're going to be doing the Better World livery. Uh, Sam and Liz went to Dublin today, did they? Oh, sorry, I haven't been, I haven't been keeping up with what they've been doing, unfortunately. I probably should. I, I don't know, I just haven't been watching the stream. I don't have to watch the streams, do I? I don't, I don't think I have to watch the streams. No, surely not. I would do the Better World livery. <laughs> because I can't be bothered buying the other one. I got this in a good pack. I think I got it in the A320 pack. Um, I saw them on approach back into Manchester. Oh, cool, did you send them the clip? Um, that would have been cool. So yeah, hello everyone. Yeah, the thumbnail is the BA uh, A320 for Jack. Um, yeah, if it's not... If it's the EasyJet... Thumbnail, guys. I apologise. We're not doing easy yet. Uh, YouTube is, um, yeah. <laughs> I should have waved at them. Plan on Virgin Atlantic tomorrow. Oh yeah, you're going to Jamaica, aren't you? Oh, send us if you're in the Discord, uh, Dave. Send us some pictures. Seriously, that would be really cool. All right, what way are we going to do? Should we do? Uh, I think I'll push back from the start. Right, which terminal of British Airways? Terminal three, aren't they? So we'll go there. Set our departure. Um, it's the BA thumbnail. Don't see any EasyJet. Yeah, it's 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 EasyJet for me. I don't know why, but I just thought as soon as I saw it, I can't have people <laughs> clicking on, looking at the title, and then going, "Hang on, why is it?" E I don't think people even do that. I don't. Tell me how how often you guys actually read um the title versus the thumbnail. I think a lot of people just look at the thumbnail and don't look at titles seriously. So I don't think it would have mattered anyway. But as soon as they saw the gameplay, they'd be like. It's not, that's not easy yet. So yeah, let's land on 23 right. Uh, sorry, 27 left. Is it 27 left, Myrtle Avenue? Yeah, 27 left we're going to land on. And I think we're pretty good. Should we do uh, a good old lockdown? Hello, Jake. Uh, I read the little, the, the, the title. See where you're going. Okay. Why has Jake been destroyed? What's going on here? Yeah, should we do a uh, lockdown? Good old lockdown. I think we should do the lockdown. So, what day did I go in the lockdown? Was it the 31st of August? Uh, the 30th of August 2020, there we go. Do live weather. Uh, I think my flight was at 9 in the morning. This is the first time I went to Heathrow. Um, I think it was, anyway. Yeah, it was. It was the first time I went to Heathrow. I think it was 9 in the morning. Yeah, that's actually the first time I went to Heathrow. <laughs> I went with Dad. Oh, it's cool, that. Right, and let's fly away. Oh no, I forgot to click out. Oh, wow, it's only Heathrow, isn't it? High altitude airways. I don't think we're going to be going that high, to be honest. It's only a short flight. Which is good because my tea's ready in about half an hour. But it doesn't take half an hour to get to Heathrow, so. Yeah, um, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, hello everyone. Da -da 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 -da. Who's in the chat? Uh, Form Freeze not here, even though he was saying yesterday he really wanted me to do it last night. Yeah, honestly, I was I was walking back from school and he was say, uh, obviously five in the evening. Uh, you know, for, for work I do, and he was just saying, "Can you please, please, please do?" Uh, what's going on? This is not this is not what the weather was like on the the thirtieth of August two thousand twenty. Usually flights such as this take twenty six thousand. Yeah. This is sort of, be, sort of be a short flight. Are you going to be going back? I don't know. I'll let you know later. Was this what the weather... This is not what the weather was like on the 30th of August, 2020. It wasn't like this. So the live weather is inaccurate. <laughs> so we just turn it off? I think we're going to turn it off. It was this very sunny day. That's all I remember. It was like three years ago, so I don't know. All right, so we boot the baby up. And it wasn't T2 either, it was T1 back then, so I don't even know what I'm doing. Batteries first, yeah, look at this. Wow, yeah, it was a very sunny day. You can go back and watch my trip report uh, if you really want to. Um, yeah, pretty cool. 
It was like two years ago, so it doesn't matter. Right, should we turn on the thing? I think I can remember I'm turning it on. Um, yeah, just give it oxygen. There we go. EPU. Beacon lights. I'm getting better at this, aren't I? And yeah, just turn on the takeoff lights just because I'm going to end up forgetting. <laughs> just do everything before you end up again. Just land in Iceland there, 767, not my best landing. Crew supply. What do you mean the crew supply? We haven't got any crew supply, it's just me on board today. <laughs> pumps are as required. Uh, pumps, do we need to turn on the pumps? Where are the pumps? I forget everything. Oh, here we are, pumps. Switch fuel pumps, oh, they're on. Engine pumps. Uh, they're not. Oh, here we are, pumps. Other pumps are on. Um, external power is... Just turn on that for now. Right, we're alive. Uh, we'll turn on the altitude. What is it normally? I think it's 19,000 feet. We're just going to go 19,000. Speed. And uh, he is on the default aircraft, so it won't let him press cruise supply. I don't even know what cruise supply is. <laughs> You're at 26,000, you think? Okay. Alright, we will go 26,000 then. So like that. That's quite... I will calculate your speed. 26,000, that's very high. Oh god, what are we doing here? Oh god, shit. <laughs> oh god, this is going to take forever. What's going on here? Oh, the game's messy, it is, it really is. Come on, hurry up. I haven't got all day. I think that's too high. I'm going to go 20, 23, just because I've done this route. Um, and that's no disrespect to you, David, because obviously you know what you're talking about. But I, I just know from flying that route, like, what, ten times? Yeah, we'll go to Heathrow, but I think it's going to be February, guys. Um, just because I've got Geneva, everything going on at the moment. Um, yeah, I think, I think we're all good. So can we request pushback? Uh, uh, just check some things. Seatbelt signs have got to be on as well. Uh... There we go. I think we're all good. I think we're all good to rock and roll. Never done this in real world. Okay. It must be really exciting for someone who's going to be flying tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I've got, I forgot to mention. Um, I'm going to uh, Lanzarote on Saturday. I'm going with Ryanair on a 737. And then, um, oh, what else? Jet 2757 on the flight back. But I'm hoping start of February I'm going to go on a... A321 to Lanzarote and then back on a 2 76 So I can do two, two troop reports. I just maybe want to get some shorts. Lanzarote, yeah. QNH, oh shit, I'm going to do that, haven't we? Uh, there we go. And we're going to request. Oh, it's ground. Ground services. Push back. Manchester Ground Airbus Alpha Sierra. Why are we pushing back? <laughs> are, you, are we pushing back to the right? To be honest, to be fair, I find Lanzarote all right. The kids like it. Yeah, it's alright, isn't it? Uh, push back to the right. Manchester Ground Airbus Alpha Sierra X ray tree 20 requesting pushback tug to steer the APU. aircraft to the right. APU's on. Oh, bleed APU. Your request has been transmitted to the operator. Yeah, okay. Come on, can we get pushed back? Hey, here we go. Need power for engines. Yeah, I'm going to start the engines up. There we go. We are going <laughs> to Heathrow. <laughs> Only if. Well, I'll decide and here we go. Good evening, Sam. Looking forward to another uh, buttery landing. Really? Buttery? I, I can't believe we got down on Sunday. Seriously, I cannot believe it. Oh, shit. My parking brake's on. <laughs> Get off my screen. I can't see. Yeah. Engine 2 first. We still got engine 2 first. Okay. Yeah, I know. I can't believe we got down. I, I seriously can't believe it. Manchester Ground Airbus Alpha Sierra X-Ray Tree 20 requesting pushback tug to steer the aircraft to the left. Yeah, just to the left a bit. Alpha, there we go. Your 
Yeah, grand, at, at least we landed. Okay, can we stop now? Can we stop? It's all just jibber jibber jabber. There we go. God knows where it's pushed us back to. Probably, probably the airport pub. Oh no, this is atrocious. Why is it parked us there? Oh, bloody game. It should park you on the taxiway. Should it, it'll push you back to the taxiway. Uh, the engines have trip switches. Um, engine one is fine. It should shouldn't cause any problems. Okay. Uh, can we turn those batteries off now? Blah 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 blah. How many of you heard that when you got on board? <laughs> the captain's speaking to our traffic control and he just goes blah 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 blah. You'd be like, fuck off, mate. Sam likes grass. No, I don't. <laughs> you need a joystick. Uh, your landings are hard because you're using a controller. Plus, you might have flight assistance on because that's maybe why you're doing firm landings. Possibly, yeah. I did it a bit wrong. I did it a bit wrong, did I? Take off runway, two tree left, climb, and maintain one zero thousand feet. Departure on one. Bye bye, Air France. Look at that. Shamrock two one tree read back is correct. My flaps, okay. They're all good, right. Okay, let's turn off the APU bleed. This thing needs to seriously get off my screen. Can I turn the pumps off? Okay, I think we're ready to taxi. The engines equal, yeah they are. Come on. Yeah, I can't wait to get the air uh, of joystick. I mean this Manchester uh thingy pack, hang on, it's taking me the wrong way. Hang on, which runway does it want me to use? Just give me a minute. Okay, we're meant to be taking off on 0, 05 left, but it wants me to take off on 23 left. What? I'm I'm gonna go the way I, I choose to go. Yeah, it wants me to go 23 left. Should we just go 23 left? But no, I wanna make it authentic and make it like the uh the good old days, you know? Okay, I'm just going to go down this way. I'm going to go. It's like sat nav. Go this way. Go to pull boat away. <laughs> go the pull boy. I'm going to go which way I bloody choose. The game isn't going to tell me. What device do you use? Well, it's the Xbox uh, Series X I'm using to play this. So, yeah. There's another aircraft coming towards us. I'm gonna have to wait for that. Which way is he going? Come on, mate! Stop waving at the crowd at the RVP! <laughs> yeah, I know. This guy! Who's flying this fucking Garfield? Come on! Okay, he's going that way. Right. Wave at the crowd at the RVP. Yeah, too many spies asking for waves. <laughs> Since when have Ryanair hired a Sunclass A330? Hired, sorry. Uh, chartered. <laughs> hired. <laughs> Hello, it's Wave. Oh, we're going to go the long way. Wave it over. Twats at the RVP. Hello. <laughs> Fix your sight. <laughs> Get proper sight managers. Oh, it was awful on Sunday. I'll tell you what. Sorry, Saturday. Yeah, filthy, it really is. Slow down a wee bit, Sam. All right. Aircraft wants to go to the the left a lot. Let's go this way. Yeah, I remember this flight when I when I went on the. Uh, the 30th of August, there was a lot of kids who wanted to go to Heathrow, you know, for all the 
Just because I think, you know, lockdown, it was like, oh, yeah, come on, let's go. Have you got the scenery pack in store for Manchester, Sam? Yeah, it's not very good. I don't, I don't like it. It's not very detailed. Now, we've got the motorway and everything underneath, but... I don't know, it's just... It's it's not... It's not the best. I don't know. Toga required. Okay, how do I set the toga up? You're going to have to tell me. I think everything's okay, though. Ugh. Oh. Go over grass to left. Yeah, we're not going to the pub though, are we, Trev? Um, one thing I would recommend is a LDG auto selector. Okay, it's okay, fifty percent. Okay, so you don't think the toga needs to be required? I'm just, I'm just going to check my audio before we we head off because it's the one thing I won't be able to check once once I'm up there. The audio is all okay as well. Yeah, okay, I think we're ready to go. I'm just going to check everything. Seatbelt signs are all on. <laughs> I'm ready to go. Okay, let's get on this runway. Check nobody's coming in. And we're off to Heathrow. Okay, I'm ready to go. Oh no, I haven't got get uh, oh it doesn't matter. <laughs> uh. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not, I'm not gonna play around. It's just gonna end in tears, isn't it? It's all gonna end in tears. And we're up in the right way, boys. <laughs> Off to Heathrow. Bye. Bye bye. That's <laughs> a steep takeoff, bloody hell. Not bad. Well, I'm going to turn on the autopilot. It's going to the left, we went to the right. And then gears down. Uh, sorry, up. Oh, sorry. If it's a short flight, uh, we are we doing a return? No, we're just doing the, the trip to Heathrow. There, uh, I'm on a bit of a time uh, limit, guys. Uh, you know, tea and stuff. You know, everyone's had tea before. Whoa! Look at the view. Woo! Where's the airport? Oh, it's way there. Look at that view, guys. Wow. <laughs> oh, shit. I've left my phone in the terminal. <laughs> that's me. That's me. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Not real, not raining. No, it's not raining, is it? We've got autopilot on, so... I can just sit back. I can tune that guitar for one, remember? Oh, Sunday. I'm sorry about Sunday. I don't know what happened. It, the autopilot crapped itself and basically, uh, it just bugged out. And then I had to fly manually to Geneva. I got down, but I'll tell you what, the game wasn't loading. Then connection issues of a server, the cloud-based rendering or whatever of the world. And then this, that and the other. So, so scared. It's a miracle I got down. I had to find my waypoints and everything. But yeah, a bit of skill there. Uh, no, we're not doing the return lag, I'm sorry. Uh, What's the journey time? Should be, uh. I don't know. It's 45 minutes, isn't it, normally? I think we're all good. Is there anything we need to turn on or off? Or well, I don't think we do. <laughs> we're heading to our destination. I had a good day yesterday. Oh, did you did you go to ten? Where, where did you go, Jake? I've forgotten. Landing lights off. Yeah, we need to turn the landing lights off. There we go. I think I'm playing okay for a controller. I mean. 
Hello, Leo. Oh, you went to Tenerife. APU off as well. Why do you have the APU on? Don't know. How about Master? Oh, we can close as well. There you go. Where are you going? <laughs> Why was it going to the left? There's no waypoints because it's not. We're not high altitude, are we? We're not doing a high altitude thing. Autopilot, Sam. Autopilot's all on. Everyone's running well. Better world delivery as well. Oh god, it's happening again. <laughs> Airbus Alpha Sierra X-ray 320. So let's let's try and find the points of interest. I know you can click left bumper in A to see uh, landmarks. But there's no landmarks in the northwest, is there? Is this shit oh <laughs> joking? Clear the controlled takeoff, uh, I'll try my best. So that's the Pennines, isn't it? And, um... Ooh. And they're all the landmarks on the Wirral. So sorry, anyone who lives in Manchester. <laughs> it was funny yesterday, because I came back from school. Um, I was walking home, and I couldn't be bothered walking. I was like, I'm shattered. You know, because it takes it out of me. Um, so I thought I'd take the train. So I looked at the Mersey Rail stuff, and the only place I could go was Spittle. Train station, so I thought, hmm... But then I thought, oh no, I'll go to Ports and Light train station. So I walked all the way to Ports and Light, which is like five miles. Um, and then I got around Ports and Light and I thought, oh, are there any sweet shops around here? And Ports and Light's like an old village. All these like really Ed old Edwardian houses. So um, I thought, no, I'll just, just go to Babington. I'll go to Babington train. So, so it ended up going <laughs> Spittle. No, 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 no. I'll go to uh, Ports and Light. No, 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 there's no sweet shop. <laughs> so I'll go to Babington train station. So I got my sweets, hopped on the train and got back home. So, uh, it's just crazy. So I had to walk oh, for an hour, just crazy. I don't know, I enjoyed it, but one of those. And tomorrow I've got college, I've got maths tomorrow. And I've got to head back to the school and I've got a guitar lesson. So I haven't got time to shit tomorrow. I'm currently doing Lisbon, Madeira, tap A320, nice. Yeah, so I did another vlog, oh cool. Who did you fly? Was it easy, Jet and Ryanair? Yeah, I'm going to land right with Ryanair and turn on the 75. What courses do you do at college? Well, I only do one, I've just started a maths one, which is tomorrow. And uh, apparently the teacher's quite strict, so... One of those. And then I've got to head back to the school and then do my stuff. I flew with Ryanair out then, easy jet back. Ah, nice. I was Ryanair. Um, Madeira landing would be a great flight sim. Yeah, it would. It would be great. <laughs> yeah, Ryanair. A lot of people say, oh, Ryanair, hard landings. I've never had a hard landing on Ryanair. I never. I remember it was coming in quite fast back from Tenerife, but... That was a Max, you know. <laughs> Maxes have a lot of problems with them. <laughs> uh, no, thanks, Dave. Appreciate it. It's a nice livery, that, isn't it? At first, when I first saw it, I was like, eh. Yeah. Well, I, I don't know. I quite like it. It's just like. It's very refreshing, isn't it? Refreshing livery. Level you might be going to. I want to go to Lisbon with Far. Um, not Faro. Um, Tap Air. But I, I think I want to do that in December, but it never happened. Um. All oh right. Okay. Let's. Speed. <laughs> Last power. <laughs> I think I f forgot to click X. I'm going too fast, son. Over speed. Over speed. Turn down the cooker. <laughs> Turn down the... <laughs> Turn down the cooker. Uh. 
Why are we going to the left? I fucked up the autopilot. I don't think you're meant to be going this way. Why is it going to the left? I screwed up my heading or something. No, back on track now. There we go. Alright, okay, I don't know what all that was about. I just don't trust the A320 in this game, I seriously don't. Turn F FD below the pressure. We'll turn on that flight directory. Yeah, we did this on Thingy Day, but it didn't. <laughs> I think it made matters worse. <laughs> and then people start arguing, saying, "Why would you need the flight directory?" I'm doing my English speech on Monday um, about the 737 Max. Oh, really? That's cool. So you, you're allowed to talk about anything to play? Yeah, I brought in Concord and the 747 when I. Uh, had to do creative writing pieces for my English. And I passed. I was like, oh, they're never going to buy this. But yeah, actually, I was talking about the, uh, how iconic they both were. How drastic. It was something to do with, ooh, make a story on, uh, or creative writing and compare to really successful rivalries or something. Rivalries. So I just thought, oh, I'll do it on the 747 and the Concorde. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I'm on the uh, VOR approach uh, from Madeira so if I'm right now oh cool hmm I will have a three month training course on it oh is this for TUI yeah because TUI for Max Uh, when it's on the purple line, it turns itself. Okay. Yeah, because I know what, when we were doing a flight once, there was a purple line here, and it, I think it guided us in. That was really helpful, but... Um, again, I'm still new to all this. Alright, where are we over now? Is that Birmingham? I think that might be Birmingham. Yeah, it is, isn't it? It's Birmingham. Pretty cool. Yeah, little flights. I mean, we don't have to be hours. Stock and Trent. Oh, you think it's Stock and Trent? Is Birmingham more that way? I don't know. <laughs> Not brummy yet. Mm -hmm. Have you seen that Tui is starting to pay for pilot training? Um, then you pay them back as you work. Oh, that's interesting. That's an interesting scheme, isn't it? Yeah, we've like two years of flight training. Hmm. Never knew you could be on, um, be one of my flights, and if you are, you can come up and visit. Yeah. Oh, I've had that with two with Teddy, and he, yeah. He's quite a uh, very approachable guy. So I wonder what you were saying, and I thought you were saying I thought uh, you were on the same flight as me. <laughs> the amount of people that messaged me saying I saw you on the flight, and I was like, what? How? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, that two Dreamliner video, Teddy, someone else, and someone else, and they've all watched the same video. We've all watched that two Dreamliner to Menorca video, and they're on the flight. Uh, obviously one guy was flying it and then the others were just passengers so yeah it's amazing how people research um, what other people's experience you'd think people would expect well, I think that's what a lot of people do people watch trip reports to see what a place is like and I would say about 60 or maybe even 70% I know that's quite high but 70% of people who watch these trip reports and this is why I do them because views and Obviously, a lot of people like to see places. I know when I'm going to Tenerife and stuff and all of that, people get to see the airline. But I think people like to see the hotels as well. 
So I think that's why the Ibiza one did really well. I never titled the Yushuai. I, ne I never put that in the title. But it's the very fact that people may have seen the logo in the thumbnail or just scrubbed through it and thought, ooh. I don't know, it's just, yeah, people like to watch trip reports to see what hotels and airlines are like before they fly them. I mean, the amount of comments I get from people saying, I'm flying Jet 2 next summer. Can't wait, I'm going down to such and such a place. You know what I mean? It's like, um, yeah, a lot of people do it for their own research. So, yeah. I'm flying uh, Ryanair's Max in April. Oh, I start to send to 10,000, okay. Uh, Bromsgrove approaching soon. Yeah, I'll start descending to... Uh, I'll start descending to... Tw Ooh, I don't know, that just seems quite a rapid descent. I'll go 14,000. And we're going down, boys. Yeah, I think that's a bit early as well. And I'm taking people's advice, that's the issue. I can't... I've got no... Knowledge of experience. There we go. It's more like it. Uh, level J, that's the issue with me. I can't afford it, so when I turn 18, I am going to apply to the TUI one, and if I don't get... Yeah, I'll have to save up for a while. I'm sure you will do well, mate. Just work hard, and I would... Recommend doing your PPL before motion sim. Yeah, I spoke to a Jet 2A330 pilot and he said, um, yeah, I wouldn't do a PPL, I'd do a glider training first. He, he recommended me doing glider glider lessons. Because he said then you get the feel of it. I think that's a fair point. But yeah, I saw him on the flight back. This was on my holiday. And he said, uh, I was said, yeah, I've, can, I've, I've had a little think about it. And he said, yeah, do it, go for it. Yeah, you know, these pilots are very friendly. Even on Tui. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Deary me. That's what Lufthansa do. They pay for training. Checking if the aircraft's not going sporadic. Funny thing is, I never wanted to be a pilot as a kid. Now, I think I'm not really fussed on being a pilot. I don't know, it's just... It's just because uh, I kind of know what we do, so... You know, I think a lot of people just think, Oh, we sit in the cockpit and they, they fly all day. That's got to be the best thing ever. But I know that it's not all like that. You know, it's a lot of calculating and... Sitting on tarmacs, getting delayed, and you know, turnarounds, and obviously when you're on standby and everything, and all that, and all this, and all that, and yeah, it's just relentless. I never get long breaks, I know that, but yeah. I wanted to be a pilot since like five. <laughs> Yes, do an early descent as you will... Oh, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Uh. Okay. Oh, God, I had a dream last night that I got the road, um, the road X. I really want that microphone, but... Yeah. I don't know. I can buy it. I could buy it right now if I want, but... You know, Geneva. Geneva. Let me go to Geneva. And the A350 and stuff. You can go on the Dreamliner after f January, but I, I think the A350 would be more impressive as a trip report. I don't know what you guys think. Right, okay, let me just have a little look at where we are. Okay, so there's Heathrow. Okay, I think we need to start descending. A little more. Let's have a look. Okay, so EGLL, that's Heathrow, isn't it? EGLL. Okay. 
10,000 feet. Might want to do Atis for weather information if you'd like to go realistic. Uh, now, we, 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 we're going to do... We're basically doing the flight... Well, well, we're doing a flight I did back in um, 2020. Did you know the A320 uses Morse code? What? Really? There it is, that's Heathrow. Hm. We're going down, boys. <laughs> that, was a, that was a very quick flight, wasn't it? They're not usually that quick. We have been going like... What's our ground speed? Yeah. 350... 357 uh, knots. So, yeah, it's quite quick. Christ. Oh, yeah, also, um, yeah, I'm going to. Oh, I've already told you, haven't I? But I might as well just remind the people who are here. Um, I'm doing a stream on Saturday from Tenerife. Sorry, Lanzarote from the. Um, not from the side of the runway. You know that little bit outside the airport in. You know when you go through the parches and they've got that outside smoking area, both ends? Yeah, I'm going to do a stream from there. On the phone, using a gimbal uh, or a Joby uh, stabilisation thing. And yeah, it should be really good. So, members chat, but can be viewed for everyone. So, the people who are members, um, yeah, can, can, can communicate with each other. And also, um, I'm back on the 7.5, so... Will give me a. Uh, <laughs> I yeah I went February last year and April last year so yeah. Shall I post the departure chart in Discord? Yeah. Look forward to watching that. Yeah, it should be good. All right, we're going down. Seatbelt signs on. Can't bloody find them. <laughs> and um. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm trying to fund a MacBook Pro, a new MacBook Pro at the moment. I'm going to be doing monthly, um, monthly payments. So what, one one hundred and five pounds a month? That's a lot of money a month, you know. What's your name in the Discord, Dave? <laughs> Disco Dave, <laughs> you call him. <them. laughs> oh, he's joined. Dave the pilot. His name is. Oh my god. I can't remember what the Morse code is used for, but all I know that it's not a feature in Microsoft Flight Simulator, obviously. Yeah, Lanzarote is nice. Uh, that's the thing about the Canary Islands, but they're all very, very different. Um, yeah. Yeah, very different. Uh, Grand Canary is a lot more upper class. Tenerife is like Blackpool. No, I'm only joking. Lanzarote is quite deserty and barren and obviously a lot of Moorish kind of architecture. So yeah, it's quite cool. Yeah, it's breezy. I remember a, a parasol flew off our uh, thingy. <laughs> right, we're going down. There's Heathrow. Done Tenerife twice now, yeah. I think in the uh, obviously June, July, all those months you'd appreciate the Balearic Islands because not as far. And uh, yeah, well, yeah, I saw Jake. I saw you, didn't I, in uh, McDonald's in Costa Rodeki? That was so weird. He was on the same flight as me. He went to Siam Park. I had just finished my stream. Right, I'm turning on to fans. Um, I just finished my stream. Hang on, where's 23 left? I just need to examine this. Um, okay, I think we're going the right way. Okay, I'm just going to turn on the autopilot again. Um, <laughs> I, yeah, it's so funny. And I just happened to be going to Costa Rodeki and uh, finished my stream. Went to the McDonald's to get some water. And he was there! He was, he having, he was drinking something or other. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> just how big just think about how big Tenerife is. And yeah, I've di I I never done Tenerife. Do you rate Tenerife? Where's well, good uh, Costa Rodeki's good to stay. 
one of the main resorts. Okay, so 23 left is... Yeah, that's Terminal 2. Sorry, Terminal 5. Okay, I think the autopilot is banking us. I've never been to Tenerife. I'm missing out on so much. Yeah, it's a pretty nice place. It's very big, though. It's very vast. Um, and yeah, yeah, Tenerife is good. If you're a bit more upper class, I'd go to Gran Canaria. Approach, it's manual. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just doing this so I can so I'm turning on the uh, thingy, thingy, my bobby. Because that's T5 down there, isn't it? That's T5. Um, yeah, because it looks out to London, doesn't it? T5 out of the big windows. So, 20... Sorry, why do I keep calling it 23 left? 27 left is just there. Okay, autopilot is off, gonna get my flaps down and everything. Uh, I don't know about speed brakes, what, 50%? Over speed. Over speed. Over speed. We're going down! Over speed. Over speed. Oh, that's gone up drastically. Over speed. Over speed. Over speed. Turn that off for a start. That's a uh, high speed. High speed, yeah, we're going to turn that down. Flaps five. Give it a sec. Well, it's a long final, isn't it? So we're... Decrease speed. Okay, we're doing that. Seatbelt signs are on as well. We should grease this, in theory. Slowly but surely, we're coming down, boys. Yeah, that's the runway we want to land on. I'm trying to make sure I'm on the right runway. <laughs> London heliport. Should we land in the London heliport? <laughs> Just for the last, Just for the last of it. You have, um, I know. I, I can't believe I got down. That's my first flight, and I got down. I don't know if you guys have watched that Tom Scott video, where it's been talked to by a mentor pilot into literally landing a plane then out without autopilot and he lands on a I think he thought it was a taxiway and it was a uh, it was actually a part of the airport roof uh funny yeah I mean even I could say oh no he he's well offline you know far from center line there you know yeah no overspeed I just don't want to stall the aircraft Okay. Well, I'm gonna have visual on the runway quite soon, so you know. Right, no more overspeed. Still wants to overspeed. I think it's because the flaps are coming down. It's uh. You guys tell me if I'm too low, okay? Turn 180. Need to zoom in, because I won't be able to see the runway. Yeah, too low, okay, we're too low. Why have my flaps gone up? Fucking messy plane, isn't it? Coming into land, boys. I just want to make sure I'm at like maybe like 48. There's like a sweet spot, isn't there? I can see the runway. I've got visual on the runway. It's 
spoilers shouldn't be armed, apparently. Okay. I think I've got a thing for spoilers. I, I, I spoil the spoilers, I really do. I spoil them with love. Gears going down. Yeah, flaps should be 15 on turn. Sorry, guys. These are armor spoilers. I know. I, I know it's quite difficult. Aim for 140 knots. Yeah, I'm coming in too fast. Oh, it's stressful as shit, guys. Here we go. Gears down. Flaps are down. I just don't want to stall it. That's the thing I'm going to shit myself on. I don't want to be like that British Airways flight, you know. Of course. Tower Airbus Alpha Sierra X ray tree 20 is 3 miles east, 1,100 feet, with India to land. With India to land? We're landing in India! <laughs> That's some dickheads thought that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. My heart. Yeah, I won't stall. Too much drag. Here we go. Oh! We got down. Fucking hell! Get that thing down! Come on! Slow down! Don't know why the reverses didn't work, I was clicking... Not E. <laughs> e. Um... B. Um, a lot then, it just wouldn't... The, the, sorry, the reverses just would not... Um, open. Right, terminal 5, isn't it? So, it's just over here. I'm clearing the runway. That's Airbus terminal 5, isn't it? On yeah, you blew A380 there. Going to 121 decimal 855 Airbus 320. Oh, we got down okay. I'm just gonna stop. I'm just gonna see if I can get somewhere to park the aircraft. Um, okay. Good thingy. Did you guys like that? At least you landed. <laughs> Smooth as silk, you think? <laughs> Tap your throttle a bit. Right, ground services. Uh, No, we don't want to request pushback. I need to go to a gate. Request taxi to parking. Yes. Ground Airbus Alpha Sierra X-ray tree two zero. Request taxi to parking. Airbus okay. Alpha Sierra X-ray tree two zero. Taxi to general aviation parking via taxiway Alpha Charlie Bravo. Okay, so where's it going to take us? All right, see you, Elon. Okay, where does it want me to go? Um, where are the blue lines? Or well, arrows, more like. June ATC, yeah, I've just done that and it doesn't want to play ball. Airbus tree two, Airbus tree two zero, please there we go. Taxiing to General Aviation Parking using Taxiway Alpha, Charlie Bravo, Kilo okay. Airbus tree two zero. Well, if you guys like that, well, I'll... Oh, shit. Um, I will continue to do more. I don't know what, I've just clicked there. I've just screwed up the... Uh, there we go. Alright, let's go. Yeah, it's not realistic at all. It's trying to take us down to T3. <laughs> not T5. Oh, that's funny. Okay, let's go this way. T3 gate, yeah, looks like it. 
Because I do know Heathrow quite well. <laughs> I'd have to know it quite well if I've done, like, what, 10 streams from there in my life. Have you tried the A310 yet? Yeah, I have. It's quite difficult. I've got the autopilot working, and I... I did uh, Leeds to Glasgow, and I got it down okay. It's quite a smooth landing, but it's very a lot more manual than this, isn't it? Um, but yeah, I've got the autopilot working pretty well. Oh, it's pretty good. Can't believe I got down. <laughs> I need to fly. Yeah, it's good. Good stuff. Yeah, it's not realistic at all, though, in terms of, ooh, go down to T3 for a, a you know, a, uh, a domestic flight. Not how it works. So, what would you guys rate that landing? It was alright, wasn't it? It was a bit bumpy, and I think it wants to get into the air again. Um, love FIFA because that's where I am from. I, I'm flying from tomorrow. Oh, okay. So, you're doing a BA flight from Manchester to... Hmm, 5 out of 10, that's not bad. <laughs> I can take criticism, don't worry. Mm -hmm. the best landing yet? 5.5 .5 out of 10. Get out the way! Look, he's braking. <laughs> I think you need to be accelerating. <laughs> I squashed it. <laughs> uh, that is funny. Uh, 3 out of 10 for Trevor. He's high maintenance him. Okay, we're going right here. Looks like it. Not too shabby, okay. There's no right landing. At least we didn't land on the grass. I just don't like it when it lands it for me. It's like all the, all the um, impressive stuff that everyone's been waiting for and building up for you know for the last two hours is just taken away from me. I don't like it at all. Yeah, I know it's out of order. Okay, that's not quite in where I was meant to have it. Should be spot on, shouldn't it? It's connecting me to a jet bridge. There we go. There we go. All nice and dandy. Yay, what's this? What are you on about? What do you mean release parking brake? <laughs> Okay, 4.5 out of 10. That's more like it. Thanks. I know, they put me out on C3. I know. Huh. We have massive help on parking. <laughs> there we go. We're all connected. We're going to shut down the aircraft and then I'll, I'll say goodbye. Uh, these pumps need to be off. That went pretty well. Are we done? Are we off? We're dead. We're out cold. <laughs> uh, for real world immersion, uh, chucks on GPU off. Okay, I don't know how to do that yet. Yet. <laughs> Just for the flight sim, Sam. It's alright. I don't know when the next gaming video will be. Um, I think it's tomorrow, isn't it? I think so, anyway. There we go. Right, that, that went pretty well. I'll, I'll log it down. Not bad. I'll save it as well. Um, save it. I'll just call it... Uh, BA. Oh, no, no, sorry. BA... 
Angst, dass das Barmann. <lacht> Und GPU is just external power, okay. Uh, three twenty now. Save it. And we can go home. <laughs> go home. Oh, it didn't go too bad. How long has it been? Fifty-six minutes. Right, that is actually the flight of a of a of a British Airways flight uh, to Heathrow. Obviously, we usually have after landing checks because the airline shouts at us if we were to leave navs on well, oh okay yeah i'll enjoy my tea didn't even know what i'm having <laughs> said it'll be ready in 40 minutes or something so yeah uh thanks for watching that was quite a short one uh see you well i'll see you on sunday yeah after lanzarote i can tell you all about it so that should be quite fun um so yeah see you guys later and uh i think Tomorrow night is, uh, is there a gaming video tomorrow night. I think there is, I don't know, I think it might be Survival Island. Uh, so yeah, see you guys later. Bye.